Hello everyone and welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. Guys, we're still in Chapter 3. We got back here to base camp. Um, I want to do something on this one, on this chapter. I didn't, I missed it on this, on the second chapter, which is the home robberies. So, um, last time I missed it with Sean and I had actually started the mission by mistake and went ahead and canceled it and then forgot to go back to it. So... My apologies, guys. Anyway, before we get started, I want to thank everyone for their ongoing support, uh, the views of the channel. I really do appreciate it. And as always, let's kick this bitch. All right, Sean. Let's go talk hey, to him. Yeah. So, tell me, is your people uh, Jacobites or English lovers, Arthur? What's a Jacobite? Our people were peasants. We had no time for politics. No. My dad would say that no politics was politics. That old world bullshit, it ain't got no place here. Why? Because there ain't no judgment here. Most folks hate the Negroes, they hate the Redskins, the Jews, even us Irish. <laughs> you ain't so free of politics. I hate everyone just the same. Well, That's right. In that case, you're gonna want what I just found for us. What's that? I was riding around a couple of days back. I come across this old cabin. Couple of fuckers lazing about outside, all liquored up. <laughs> I didn't think nothing of it. But then I come across this hunter down by the river. And he tells me they're a stick up crew. Says they hit a train a couple of days back near Emerald Ranch. Nice fella he was, shared a bottle we did. Then I robbed the bastard blind. <laughs> and you believed him? No reason not to. If he's right, it'll be a big haul for us. I saw three of them, maybe more, but I reckon you and me, we could take them real easy. All right. What the hell? Let's go check it out. <laughs> Damn sons of bitches. Think they're mean? <laughs> they're about to get a lesson in mean. Okay. You just keep your cool, you hear me? Yep. Which Sean has a problem Roy, with anyway. Follow me. Hey. Yeah. How far is here. this place? It's a bit of a ride, not too bad. Back up north to stretch, not far from the state line. All right. Oh, I'm gonna talk to his ass. So, what were you doing riding around up there anyway? Sniffing around, looking for a take. I got a long nose for these things. Dutch has always honored us to get out there and bring in money, ain't he? And rightly so. I ain't like some of them others back there, sitting around waiting to be told I go after it. I see you sitting around plenty. I mean, I don't need no coddling like the rest. Dutch knows my value to the cause, as from the moment I met him. You tried to kill him, if I remember the story right. And he kept me around, didn't he? He saw something in me. He said as much. I'm sure. Dutch is good at seeing things in people. And while we're talking about money, you are clear on how this works. We split half, other half goes to the gang. Dutch keeps all our savings hidden in a safe spot outside camp. Yeah, yeah, I know. How many times do you have to tell me? Well, what's that box by his tent for then? Camp funds, supplies and the like. Yeah, you're supposed to put money the in there, too. The fact you don't know that suggests you clearly ain't put much in it. But all this baby weight, don't you worry. You're sure you scoped this place out right? Yes, see? That's why I wanted you along for this. You're still a doubter. I ain't just some dumb kid. I've lived a lifetime of shit already. And you sure don't keep it bottled up inside. Yeah, right? What about that train job with the oil wagon? Made a good show in there, didn't I? He got knocked out. Ah, that's what you choose to remember. We got paid. We got out of there. Got knocked out in Blackwater, too, didn't you? <laughs> Seems <laughs> like a... Uh... Chaos. Huh. Did you get split off Mac? Nope. Didn't see him. I lost your boys at some point when he was getting out of town. They caught up with Mac a couple of days after. Davy was finished by the time we got up the mountains. Jenny didn't even make it that far. Those bounty hunters strung me up, beat me, pulled teeth, burned me feet. I didn't breathe a word about nothing, I swear. Good. 
And it's time folks stop giving Dutch a hard time about all that Blackwater business, if you ask me. The man's not a fortune teller. You can plan, you can use your head, but you never really know what you're walking into. Yep. Folks always want to blame someone when things go wrong. Okay. Hard left coming up. All right, it's going to be off the road up ahead. Up here, Morgan. Let's leave the horses here and go the rest on foot. I want them to hear us coming. Okay, hang on. Yeah, I'll deal with them. Let's make sure. Let's see here. Yes. Keep one of them alive to tell us where they stashed the money. Hope you know what you're doing. Just for that long distance silent kill. Now, guys, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to get through the story before the online kicks in. And then I'm going to go through each individual town and snoop. Look. And try to get uh, this is good. the it info. Is. Leave it to me. I'll do the talking. You hang back. Try to get the info on things I've missed. About five seconds to get the hell off my property, boy. Uh, look, don't want no trouble. Just thought you might like to know we passed a big posse alarm and headed this way. There were a dozen of them coming up east. What? Where? Right here. Yeah. It's a marker. Rest of them. You'll tell me where that money stashed. Well, all right, all right, take it easy. Behind the, the wall in the bedrooms, if you stick your hand between the gap. All right, you go grab the money. We'll keep an eye on sunshine here. All right, first things first. We're gonna loot these boys. You know what? Just get the hell out of here. And don't look back. Some good stuff. You <sighs> stupid, get out of the damn way before I throw you in the fire. Why don't you see what else you can find, Sean? Oh, a cigarette card. I told you we'd take him, no problem, didn't I? You did good. Let's see what the pay is first. Dug this up all by myself. A proper lead. All right, all right. You heard him, right? He said the stash was behind a loose board in the bedroom. You find that thing yet? Don't want to overstay our welcome, do we? Hey, the 
It's over there. Oh, excuse the hell out of me. What do we got here? Another gun. I will take it. Hey, right. this is more like it. Good work. Hey, what about my car? I found a place, didn't I? All right, here. But don't forget to give the camp its share. Supplies That's right. don't appear by magic, you know. All right, don't need the lecture again. I'll see you back at camp. Never know. Folks got stashed. <laughs> There's gotta be other places out there like this. It's always good to be thorough. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna use that for fishing. Oh. I just walked right past something. Hang on. for details. Charles asked for some moonshine. Okay. We can do it. What did that say? Oh, pick up stranger. I don't want to pick him up. Nothing else. Don't no worry about that. That's it. Off we go. I gotta loot that one body out there. This guy right here. Hey, boy. 